السلام علیکم و رحمۃ اللہ وبرکاتہ ڈیئر آڈینس آئی ویلکم آل آف یو ٹو ٹریٹمنٹ ود قرآن اینڈ ٹوڈے ویل ویل ٹاک اباؤٹ اے ویری سیریس پرابلم اے لاٹ آف پیپل فیس اینڈ یو نو موسٹ آف دا پیپل ہیو یو نو فیشل پرابلمس دے آر یو نو افیکٹیڈ بائی اسکن پرابلمس سم آف دا پیپل ہیو بلیک اسپاٹس ریڈ اسپاٹس Uh, or black heads or they are facing uh, facial discoloration or melasma these are the some some common skin problems most of the people are, are going through now the question is that whether uh, these issues are you know medical or uh, does evil eye have anything uh, to do with it uh, so we all know that uh, these problems can be caused uh, by medical issues like infection there can be a wide range of diseases like infection like inflammation uh, and uh, autoimmune processes and excessive medication can also be the reason for that uh, but uh, the question most of uh, uh, our audience asks um, especially women they ask that um, a few days ago or some months ago my uh, skin color was fair i had a very smooth and moisture uh, you know skin but suddenly it appeared to be dull and uh, it turned out to be black and pale and i don't know what happened uh, so does it have any links to evil eye or it is just a um, you know medical issue so this will be our today's topic and i want to make it clear that uh, uh, whether your skin problems are caused by you know some medical uh, issues or problems or is it related to uh, black magic or evil eye so look the very first thing i want to make clear is that uh, evil eye is reality we all know that we all know that evil eye is reality and we have a very very strong reference of prophet muhammad peace and bless be upon him he said al aynu haqqun prophet muhammad sallallahu alaihi wasallam said al aynu haqqun evil eye is effective it is reality and he also uh, you know added the words that if there is something that could overcome destiny if there is something that can change the destiny and fate of a person it will definitely be evil eye so evil eye can even dominate our fate and our destiny so the, the the thing i want to make clear is that it is reality so we must understand the fact that evil eye does not necessarily affect human face it can you know uh, it can have many effects in human life it can cause um, you know, financial issues it can cause you know personal issues it can also cause domestic issues as well like for example a man can have um, loss in business because of an evil eye or he may have uh, weakness of muscles he may have numbness in the body or there can be some other issues that can be personal excessive you know depression or insomnia all these things are or can be related to evil eye so the question remains the same that evil eye can evil eye cause uh, uh, facial rashes or black spots black heads or um, uh, discoloration of the face or melasma or other skin and facial diseases or not uh, let me make it very clear that there is a very strong reference and uh, it is narration of hazrat umm salma radiyallahu ta'ala anha uh, she said that prophet muhammad peace and blessings be upon him came to her house and what happened ان النبي صلى الله عليه وسلم راى جاريه في وجهها صفات رسول الله صلى الله عليه وسلم came to my house and he saw a young girl having black spots dark spots and uh, a term we use black heads on her face and what pro- what does prophet muhammad peace and bless be upon him say he said that istarqu laha fa inna biha nazra Rasulullah sallallahu alaihi wasallam said make ruqya spell on him that she is affected by evil eye so 
we have uh, you know uh, an authentic reference of the saying of prophet muhammad peace and blessed be upon him that evil eye can really cause our facial problems and skin problems now many people will ask how can we differentiate uh, between uh, these two dimensions that whether uh, our facial problems are caused by medical issues or it is related uh, with evil eye or black magic so it is very simple and quick if uh, you are diagnosed by medical you know symptoms medical issues it will definitely be a medical issue you should go for its treatment and if it uh, you know uh, uh, these things appear on your face without any genuine medical issue then it is evil eye so what can be the possible treatment of evil eye with chronic references and hadiths of prophet muhammad sallam. so here are some steps you should uh, take when you are affected by evil eye uh, first of all, you need to recite three times Ayatul Kursi and you need to recite Mawazatan, Surat Al Falak and Surat Al Nas three times. Then recite supplication, Ad Dua, Holy Prophet, peace and rest be upon him, taught us, and that is A'uzu bi kalimati Allahi Tamma min kulli shaytanin wa hamma wa min kulli ayni lam. Recite it three times and you should also recite Surat Bakra once a day and you should also recite the last verses of surah al-baqarah and it will inshallah inshallah heal you within seven days